This is a very short video about John chapter 3, verses 3 to 7. And it's about being born again. Today, Trevor and I spoke with a couple of Jehovah's Witness women who are less resistant to the Holy Spirit than men indoctrinated, of course, with the beliefs of the Jehovah's Witness movement, but less resistant, that's the, that's the word, less resistant to the Holy Spirit. And the Spirit of the Sovereign Lord is upon us to preach the good news. The same Spirit of the Sovereign Lord upon Christ who's in us speaking in us and through us to these two Jehovah Witness women. So I'm just going to read this to you, John chapter 3, 1 to 7. Now there was a man of the Pharisees named Nicodemus, a member of the Jewish ruling council. He came to Jesus at night and said, Rabbi, we know you are a teacher, who has come from God. For no one could perform the miraculous signs you are doing if God were not with him. In reply, Jesus declared, I tell you the truth. No one can see the kingdom of God unless he is born again. Nicodemus asked, How can a man be born when he's old? Surely, he cannot enter a second time into his mother's womb to be born. Jesus answered, I tell you the truth, no one can enter the kingdom of God unless he is born of water and the Spirit. Flesh gives birth to flesh, but the Spirit gives birth to Spirit. You should not be surprised at my saying you must be born again. Verse 8. The wind blows where it pleases. You hear the sound, but you cannot tell from where it comes or where it is going. So it is with everyone born of the Spirit. How can this be? Nicodemus asked. You are Israel's teacher, said Jesus, and do not understand these things? I tell you the truth. We speak of what we know, and we testify to what we have seen. But still you people do not accept our testimony. I have spoken to you of earthly things, and you do not believe. How then will you believe if I speak of heavenly things? No one has ever gone into heaven except the one who came from heaven, the Son of Man. Just as Moses lifted up the snake in the desert, so the Son of Man must be lifted up, that everyone who believes in him may have eternal life. So with these two Jehovah Witness women today, I was speaking to one, Trevor was speaking to the other. And bear in mind, we are in the Holy Spirit, who is wanting to teach people about Christ. So I said to the one I was talking to, are you born again? And she said very clearly, no, because I'm not going to heaven. I'm remaining on earth. Now, I'll leave that with you. That was new to my ears today. They've made their minds up. They're not going to heaven. They don't need to go to heaven because they're remaining on earth. God bless you, brethren of the one God. is one church throughout this world. Pray for us in Norwich, UK, as we pray for you. And this is the 8th of November, 2022. Speak again by the grace of God. God's will. God bless.